Thank you for joining me for today's pre-search tutorial video. Deposits and withdrawals of the pre-token are now available on the pre-search platform for both the Ethereum and base chains. This is a step closer towards full Web3 integration for pre-search. On this video, I will show you how to deposit and withdraw pre-tokens for both the ETH and base chains on the pre-search platform. We are at presearch.com. I'm going to show you how to deposit your pre tokens first, and then I'm going to show you how to withdraw them. So we're going to click on the pre token balance on the top right side. You will see your pre wallet. This is where you will also find your usage rewards from searching and your search stake, which we will be covering in another video. Click on the pre wallet. And if you have any tokens available to withdraw, the balance will show here. Below that, there's withdraw tokens, deposit tokens, and stake tokens for search staking. There is a 24-hour lockup period for search staking withdrawals to prevent gamification, but there is no lockup period to deposit and withdraw any tokens you send that aren't currently staked. Next, we're going to click on deposit tokens to deposit pre-tokens on both the Ethereum and base chains. That's right. You can send both Ethereum and base pre to the same address. So you should see a QR code and a 0x address that you can copy and paste. And if you don't see this, click on this green transfer methods box and choose from blockchain. You can also transfer pre-tokens from usage rewards as long as you have or earned more than a thousand pre-tokens in the usage rewards or from node rewards as well. You should now see this QR code and the 0x address that you can copy and paste to deposit your pre-tokens again on both the Ethereum and base chains. So I'm going to deposit both using MetaMask to show you how. So I'm going to copy my 0x address, I'm going to go to my MetaMask wallet. Again, make sure you're on the correct chain. Right now I'm using Ethereum. I'm going to send my pre-search tokens. Pressing send, I'm going to go ahead and paste in the address that's coming up. And I want to go ahead and do my entire balance of pre-search. That's 21,437 pre-tokens. Clicking next. Again, this is for the Ethereum blockchain. Confirm and it's showing that it's pending currently. Now, before I send pre on the base chain, I wanna make sure that this transaction completes. It shows that it is confirmed. I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna refresh. Okay, we are back at our pre wallet and you can see that deposit was successful for 21,437 pre tokens on the Ethereum blockchain. So I'm gonna go back to deposit tokens just to make sure I'm going to copy the address once again, I'm going to go to my MetaMask wallet and I'm going to switch chains. So right now I'm going to be switching to base. We are on the base mainnet. I'm going to go to my pre-token, going to go to send. I'm going to paste in the address once again, and we're going to send the max amount of pre, which is 6,001 and some change of pre-token. Click next and follow all the protocols on the MetaMask wallet. Confirm. And the transaction is showing confirmed for sending the 6,001.5894941 dot 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 worth of pre tokens. So we're going to go back to our pre wallet and check and confirm that. So let's give it a moment for the deposit to show up. Okay, and you can see that deposit went through for the 6,001 point change of pre-tokens. So that makes a total of 27,439 tokens that I currently have in my pre-wallet. So at this point, I have shown you how to successfully deposit your pre-tokens on both the Ethereum and base chains. So now we're going to move on to the next part of the video and show you how to withdraw. Okay, now to show you how to withdraw your pre-tokens. We're going to need to go to our pre-wallet, and there you're going to find the pre-token balance that is available to withdraw. And we're going to click on Withdraw Tokens. If you have not already set up your two-factor authentication, withdrawing tokens requires two-factor authentication to be turned on. So I'm going to need to set up my 2FA before I can show you how to withdraw your pre-tokens. If you're not familiar with what two-factor authentication is, I will have a link down below in the video description for a video that will explain what 2FA is. 
So I now have my two-factor authentication activated. I'm gonna go back to my pre-wallet. I'm gonna go back to withdraw tokens. And this is where you can click the number of tokens, put the wallet address, and make sure you're using the correct network. So at this point, I'm gonna be using the Ethereum network. So I'm gonna be going to my wallet and copying my Ethereum address, my ERC20 address for pre-search. I'm gonna paste that into the wallet address and we're gonna do maximum amount of tokens. I also need to make sure I include my 2FA. Click withdraw. Make sure you read the terms and conditions. I'm pressing continue. It says, your withdrawal request has been received. Please check your email and click the confirm my withdrawal button in the confirmation email to proceed. So I'm gonna do that and then we will continue with the video. Okay, so now it says your withdrawal is ready for you to process. You may now complete your withdrawal by connecting your Web3 wallet and clicking process withdrawal below. So I'm using MetaMask and I'm gonna go ahead and connect and follow all the prompts to connect up with my MetaMask wallet. Confirming everything here. It shows that we are connected and I'm gonna go ahead and confirm withdrawal. Now again, make sure that you are using the correct chain, Ethereum or base in your receiving address. So make sure you're using the correct chain, make sure you have everything correct. And once you have all the information correct, you can then confirm withdraw. So confirming withdraw, clicking on process withdraw and confirming, submitting your transaction. So as you can see, we have success. You could check your transaction status on Etherscan. So at this point, I'm gonna pull up my MetaMask wallet Go back to my tokens and you can now see that I have 21,437 tokens, which was the amount of tokens that I sent from the pre-search platform. So I have shown you successfully how to withdraw your pre-tokens. Again, make sure you're using the correct chain, ETH or BASE in your receiving wallet. Sometimes it's the same address, but just make sure that you have all the correct information. So I've shown you how to withdraw your pre-search tokens I've shown you how to deposit your pre-search tokens, both on the Ethereum and base chains. So I encourage you to check out the next video, which is all about search staking, supercharging your search rewards. I will also have links down below in the video description and the pinned comment for the playlist that we created with all the pre-search tutorial videos. Make sure you subscribe and smash that like button if you haven't already.